My mommy says that I'm a good boy, and if I eat all my vegetables and pee on the plate, peas on the plate, that she'll buy me an all-day sucker at the all-day sucker store, and I can eat eat my all-day sucker all day long, and you can't. And, and 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 my mommy says I'm very special. That she's never seen or known such a special boy in all her life, and and I believe everything mommy says. And why shouldn't I? Look what she produced, baby. Beautiful. Huh? Did your mother produce something like this? No. Of course not. Huh? Oh, sure. You know, you've got some some uh, features that are okay. You know, but nothing like this. Nothing, <laughs> nothing first class like this. Heavens, no. Anyway, I hope you all have a nice weekend and that you can get all your ducks in a row and you have nice food and you've got some real nice things planned for me and may, maybe a picnic or maybe a stroll in the park and maybe you going to a nice movie and having popcorn and maybe a great big bottle of coke and 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 maybe some of you are going to a date you know maybe maybe you're going to pick up, uh, you know, your date and you're going to go out on the town and going to go to a nice fancy restaurant and you're going to act like you're a big shot, aren't you guys? Huh? You're going to act like a big shot. You know, take her to a fancy restaurant so you can get into her panties. I know. <laughs> I know what you're doing. Sickening. Absolutely sickening. I see right through ya. If I was a woman, you know, and some guy like you, you know, tried to, you know, con me with movie tickets and a box of chocolates and, <clears throat> you know, a nice restaurant afterwards, I wouldn't put out if you're the last man on earth. Why? Because I'm not supposed to. Mommy said I'm not supposed to. If you're a woman and you are making moves on me just so you can get in my pants, I'd be disgusted with you. Really. I don't want any nonsense like that. I'm a no-nonsense guy and I want you to be a no-nonsense woman, you know? Before the hanky-panky goes on, I want to see your checkbook, you know? I need to see your bank account, your savings account. If you can't, you know, bring in, you know, $3,500 a month, then what am I wasting my time with you for, huh? I need a woman that's, that's sexy, thin, young, and willing to, for me to, you know, make her happy for the rest of my life anyway. You know, when I'm dead, she can do anything what she wants to do. But I want her to cater to me, you know, and, 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 and to beckon to my ever call, you know. If I say, honey, I like a BLT this morning and a great big, uh, you know, glass of orange juice, she hops to it. Like that, right in her bunny suit. She hops in her bunny suit, puts on her bunny suit, and she goes in the kitchen, and she makes it. Then she hand feeds it to me, baby. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. Are you that woman? No, seriously, are you that lucky woman? If you are, contact me. And we'll see what we can do. Really. You know, we'll, we'll see if we can work it out. We should be able to work it out. You know, I overlook a lot of things. If you have a pimple, you know, on your chin or, you know, a freckle on your rear end or whatever, uh, we can, I can overlook that. I can overlook it if you're an inch short. You know, maybe you have, uh, you know, a few hairs missing on your head. I don't care. You know, 
If you're nice to me, then I'll be nice to you. I, I'll be nice to you anyway, because that's the way I was brought up. And that's what my mommy says, that I'm a nice boy, and I'm a sweet boy. I'm a sweet boy, and I deserve all the blessings and, uh, and all the gifts that, that I can possibly receive in this life, and you're not coming through with anything, are you? Oh, you're special. Why should you send Rod money? He can get by. That's not the point. That's, that's not the point that I can get by. The point is, you need to give in this life, and why not give to me? I'll spend your money like it was mine, and it should be mine. No, I really should. Why should you have more than me? That doesn't make sense. Why should you be driving a nice new car around, and I'm driving a 20-year-old car around, you know? You've got the latest equipment, you got, you know, GPS, and you've got a nice CD player, and uh, rack, and pin <laughs> rack and pinion steering, or whatever. But what do I have? I'm lucky if I have power steering in my car. Air conditioning? Hell, air conditioning for me is rolling down the damn windows. But not you. You've got air conditioning, you've got dual seating uh, heating. Telling you, you make me sick. You've ruined my whole, thinking about what you've got and, and the things I don't have. You've ruined my whole flipping weekend. I was hoping to have a nice weekend that I can relax. And I can rest up for the week ahead. But, you, but thinking about what I don't have and thinking about the things you have makes me want to go puke. <laughs> unbelievable unbelievable some of you are giving I know that but even the ones that have given me money haven't given enough do you think I'm happy with a 20 spot no I'm not happy with a 20 spot why should I be happy with a 20 spot when I know you have a hundred dollar bill in your wallet huh give give Said the little stream, give or give or give or give. And my mommy said that I'm supposed to be a good receiver and I'm and, and I'm 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 going to receive every wonderful uh, dollar bill and five and ten spot and twenty dollar bill and fifty and a hundred dollar bill that you can give me. I'll even take silver bars. And coup grads and, uh, you know, uh, walking liberty uh, half dollars or Morgan dollars or I'll take it all. I'll take it all and you'll receive the blessings for it. Don't you get it? I'm doing the hard part. I'm taking your damn stuff. A bunch of losers.